Well, today we want you to meet our British version of Greta. 12-year-old Jocelyn Goldstein joined the protest a few days ago and she's here alongside her dad, Sam. Uh, welcome to both of you. Thank you Thank for you. being here today, especially you, Jocelyn. Well, I mean, you're, you're 12 years old, so you're the youngest, one of the youngest protesters there. Um, what compelled you to be part of it? Um, well, every time I go, it's kind of a really, like, inspirational time and I just feel kind of more and more part of it every time I go. I think Greta Thunberg kind of introduced me to it. And, um, yeah, she kind of inspired me to do what I'm doing now. So, yeah. at, at home, how environmentally friendly are you and your family? Um, well, we got rid of our car uh, about a year and a half ago. And we, um, we I've gone vegetarian. Mm -hmm. yeah, mm -hmm. since the protests. And we, um, in the winter, we don't really turn off our heating. And we've recently started, um, when we, like, have a bath or shower, we save the water and empty it into our garden mm -hmm. to so feed... So you're doing all to... good steps to, yeah. to make a difference within your home, which is what we all need to take responsibility of. Um, you must be proud of her, Sam, as yeah. a dad, that yeah. she, you know, here's a child that is thinking about other things, not just what's, you know, what social media or what her friends are up to, but something that's really going to make a difference. Yeah, definitely. I mean, I was worried, to be honest, when she said, I'm going to go on strike from school this week uh, when they're due to be back. I was a little bit worried, but she's got a really good mind and she really is passionate about this. And I think she kind of understands that it is an, an important issue. It's an emergency and um, she's doing her best to respond to that. Yeah. Have um, you had to have time off from work to take her to the bank? We have had to juggle it about. We said to her, let's do it this week and see how it goes. Mm. And um, so, yeah, it's inconvenienced us. Yes, I bet. But I think it's, for, for Joss and for everybody, I think it, it's an inspiration. She's an inspiration, I think. And yeah. just of you, I mean, this is, isn't this sort of a mess that as adults that we should be sorting out, that it, really the children should, you know, once they grow up, they can just sort things out for themselves? Do you think that actually the fact it's got so bad that children now have to go, hang on a minute, this is our planet, we're the next ones in line, we need to make yeah. a change now? Well, it's like, as I think you've heard, like, it's our future. Um, the adults aren't doing anything in Parliament and we need to act now. And also, children kind of rebelling against adults kind of is really unusual and mm. I think that's kind of why it's, like, made the media and stuff like that. No, it's going to be your planet. You're going to inherit yeah. the yeah. mess that we've left behind, exactly, that's for yeah. sure. Yeah. Um, well done. Thank, thank you. Yes, very much, lovely, to lovely to meet you. Thank, thank you very much.